Hey, it's me again. Oh, yeah, you're that new user. Yeah, the new user. Hey, as you know, because you check my drawings, I'm terrible at spelling. And sometimes I forget to do my spell check, which I know I should. And, oh, you're not that great at math either. Yeah, I'm also bad at math. Well, I got a suggestion. If it would be great if there was some kind of way that I could just pick from a list of existing words that are already correctly spelled. Oh, you mean something like favorites? Yeah, something like favorites. That would be perfect. Is there anything like that in MicroStation when I'm placing text or placing a note? Well, you're in luck. There is. Oh, awesome. That's great. Can you show me how to do that? Oh, and I'd love to show it to you. It would make my job so much easier. Thank you. We're going to talk about how we can add in text using the text favorites. So I'm going to be demonstrating this using my place note tool. So right up here under the placement group, I'm going to click on place note. On my tool settings window, I have my settings set the way that I want to. On the text editor window, our insert text favorites is located right here. If I click on this, you're going to see I have one already placed in this file as a demonstrator. That's the word that the new user couldn't spell. So I'm going to start my note. I'm going to type in first part, which is going to be remove space. Now to use the text favorite, I click here. I choose the text favorite I want. It populates my text editor here. How can I add in a text favorite on the fly? So let's say I've got more of my note. That's going to be C construction detail. So I'd like to make this into a text favorite. So I just select it here. And I'm doing this on the fly. With that text selected, I right click on my mouse. Menu appears about halfway down. Save text favorite. The text favorite window appears. It shows me that it's truncated, but it appears there. It shows me it's there. Now I can go ahead and I can just place in my note and I'm using AccuDraw and then I'm going to do a shift tentative to bring up my snaps because I want to snap to an element and I hit reset and there we are. To look at the text favorites manager, if I go click here, see the list at the bottom, there's manage. This will open up the text favorite manager. Now, these two text favorites happen to be local in this file. They're not available in other files if I opened them up. If I expand this, you're going to see listed the two text favorites. Normally, what an organization would do, if they had text favorites they want everybody to use, they would put them in a DGN lib file and then using variables, point MicroStation to that DGN lib. That way, people wouldn't have to create their own. But if you did create your own, they would exist only in the file that you're in. So if I choose, let's say, Pilaster, you can see it shows up here. I can change things like applying a text style. I can use spell check. I can use font, text height, and I can set uh, the other settings like justification, underline, and so on. We also have an option down here to use insert field to get properties for elements. That's really powerful, but that's another video. So that's how we use text favorites and we can create them on the fly or better yet, put them in a DGN lib and make it available to everybody in your organization. Happy texting. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.